Hello, this is Ironhead 41. I'm going to show you how to clean out one of these big 275 gallon totes. I traded this one. The guy brought me an empty in swap for the one that had 135 gallon of machine oil in it. Uh, he said he could burn it, so he brought me this one. And I put a whole gallon of Dawn dishwashing liquid in it, and I'm going to fill it up with water uh, until the water just keeps coming out. There ain't no more soap suds. As you can see, as it fills up, it is cutting the transmission fluid oil out and pushing it up and it will push it completely out. Well that's pretty ain't it? <laughs> like snow. Now let's open this valve and get this drained out. Oh this won't take long. All the way. Oh yeah. Oh wife's going to kill me. We're going to fill the yard up with soap suds. Boy you got your school shoes on. Boy, go in the house and change your shoes. Right, I've got this thing tilted, ripping the inside out. You see the red? Just cut it right out and shove it right out that valve right there. All right, she's good and cleaned out. We're going to close the valve. Now we're going to add two pounds of baking soda, and that will cut the soap. Just like that. And then we're going to refill it up with water. All the way to the top. Should take about 30 minutes. Now you see that? No soap suds at all. Baking soda cuts the soap. Boy, and that water's crystal clear. This thing cleaned up nicely. Alright, once this thing is full, I'm going to drain it. And then I can put it in place where I want to put it. And then uh, that uh, little nipple there coming out from that valve, that's a two inch. What I got is a two inch by half inch valve with a little water spigot on it. I can hook a water hose to. Uh, the bell, the valve, and the Teflon I think cost me $11. Screw that on there and I'm set to go. Just remember, dishwashing liquid cuts oil. Baking soda cuts soap. Very simple, easy to clean. Well that's it.